ask your question again. If, if I didn't know I was born gay or born straight, what? There's no such thing. There is proper abuses and there's proper uses of your body. It's that simple, ma'am. And, and, and why should even kids be subjected to it either way? Oh, oh yeah. Sir. Okay. Yeah. How you doing? Yeah. Uh, I'm the boss man, SPD. Got it. All right. Hey, we just got caller here. Supposedly, okay. There was you guys were following people to the cars, and I no, make sure you know, I'm not. I am respecting right of passage and natural rights. Yeah. No, I appreciate it. You got it. As long as you can just keep it civilized. Okay, I'll doctor. Let's see, D. But I'll call you doctor. <laughs> no. Boscovich. Sorry, boss. Nice. Yes, sir. And your yes, badge number, please. Thirteen forty-five. Thank you so much. And you're with Henderson, right? Yes, sir. Got sir. it. Simply Thank you. Officer. All right. I'm the point yeah. of contact. My name is Arthur Shopper. Thank nice you. To meet you again, I mean, sir. my hands are full, but just keep it civil. Please. Absolutely. Don't make any contact with people coming in. No. And we'll be just fine. Absolutely. I appreciate it, sir. Okay. And it, the, the issue is we've actually been harassed by a few, so <laughs> that's what we're ensuring. Okay. We're, we're we're respecting people's personal space. You, 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 I'll help you call us. Thank you. I'll come out. I'll come out. I'll call. Okay. You. Nobody should be trashing guys and okay. vice versa. So, so we got 1345, right? Yes, got 13, it. Thank you. Thank okay. You, All right. You know, that one lady, she says, like, if people aren't born gay, when did you know you were born straight? It's like this concept of sexual orientation is nonsense. And now they want to teach it to kids? Because that's what this is. I mean, this is what they're, they're trying to normalize this insanity. There they go. Right there. Now I want you to notice something. Did you notice how he, he all he said was keep it civil? Mm -hmm. She told me, oh, you can only go there. Now she told me, okay, I got to show this to everybody. So I'm going to document this. So Miss Smedley over here lied to me and said that I can only go there or there in the free speech area. So let's take a look here. I want this documented for everybody. So they wanted to call this a free speech area. This is a free speech area. Yeah. So part of the reason we do this is to equip and encourage others. Don't let them pull that crap. Oh, you got to go over there. No, we don't. Uh -huh. Miss Medley, you lied to me, ma'am. You're a public official. You're a public servant. And you lied to us and said that we couldn't exercise our First Amendment rights. But it's okay for a drag queen to read to children pushing this perversion. Okay. Unreal. So I was talking to another guy and he says, oh, you're on the losing side. Well, see, it's that attitude. It's that attitude of, well, there's nothing we can do. No, there is a lot of things you can do. If people just step up and start making noise and saying, we're not going to tolerate this. We've shut down drag queen story hours in Georgia, in Ohio. We have upended it in L.A. In L.A. County, we went after this one drag queen who had naked pictures of himself on Instagram. And for some reason, they're not scheduling them anymore. These are the, this is... These are not role models. Police officers, firefighters, news anchors. How about army veterans? How about them? Those are our, those are our role models.